Steve Neal was born on July 5th, 1972, and has been playing music practically ever since. When I was six, uh, for Christmas, my parents bought me a little tiny keyboard um, with a little color-coded book of songs, like Mary Had a Little Lamb and things like that. And by the end of that day, by the end of that Christmas day, I could play all of the songs in the book. Neil attended St. John Vianney High School, where he truly realized the extent of his musical ability. Uh, when I was pretty much um, one of the best musicians in my school, um, and I knew at that point that I wanted to make music a career because it was really the only thing that I could do. <laughs> After graduating from Vianney, Neil attended SIU Edwardsville, where he studied music. However, after a few years, Neil decided to leave the school to tour with an a cappella ensemble. I learned how to be a professional. I learned what the music business was. I learned um, how to, to interact with fellow musicians and with other music professionals. After touring for five years, Neil went back to school at Berklee College of Music in Boston, Massachusetts, where he earned his degree in film scoring. This program taught him yet another skill, conducting. His arms would come up and everybody would be like holding their breath, waiting to see what he, you know, what he was going to do next and where he was going to direct. And it was like the whole time he just, it was what I imagine that a great conductor does all the time. Is they're just connected to him through the music. After Neil graduated from Berkeley, he returned to his hometown of St. Louis, where he took a job as the music teacher at a local all-girl Catholic high school, Villa de Chen. When he started teaching here was when he would come home and you could tell how much he liked it. That helping the girls find like who they were and the power that was part of performance and part of music, uh, excited him. We love him a lot, he's taught us a lot, and not only about just like performing and acting and things like that, but like really about being ourselves on stage and off. Music is just one of Neil's many strengths. He is one of the most sensitive, caring people. He's a good listener. He, he hears things that you're not always saying, and that's part of what makes him an awesome husband and an awesome friend.